Ladies and gentlemen of the town squad, welcome back to another VGC 2018 Battle Spot Rank Live. Today, I think is going to be the grand finale of this lovely Rhyperior team, and it did pretty damn well. So next time, guys, leave suggestions in the comments down below for what you, what team you guys want to see a Pokemon that I build around. What kind of Pokemon do you want to see, my friends? Let me know in the comments down below. Now, game one, we have Yellow Flesh of the QR Code team, the Ganadel, Kangaskhan, Lando, Heatram, Tapafini, Cresselia. Basic freaking vanilla crapola, if you ask me. There ain't no flavor to that team just yet, unless we see them some cool moves, but bleh to that team. Anyway, we're gonna have to see uh, most like a Cresselia lead, and probably uh, I wanna go right here because Rapier is a great matchup against everything here. Except for Low Kick Kangaskhan and Sapu Finny. I can still Ice Punch Lando and Neg 1. EQs can eat up pretty well. And with Rhyperior Cresselia, I can spam my own EQ for Naganadel and Heat Ram. Uh, but at the same time, if you. Uh, you know what? We'll give Rhyperior a chance. We'll go, we'll go Cresselia Rhyperior. Then we'll back it up with. Uh. I guess Finny's a pretty good back. I mean, these are the Nagana. They'll probably make him more while. So we'll go Finny more while. No fake out on the Incineroar. We should have go like that, my friend, in game one. I don't like uh, Fire Throw in this matchup that much. Heat Rain easily kills in the Nagana. They'll hit with a Flamethrower or Fire Blast. If he has it, most likely he does. Uh, other than that, I don't know. We could have we gone different ways, but I'm going to go this path right now. See what happens, my friends. That will be our game one on the winner. So our point of final locks in. And with that being said and done, guys, if you're excited for some more videos in the channel, show some love to that like button down below. I'd greatly appreciate that. And of course, guys, leave a comment as well of what Pokemon you want to be built around next. That'd be awesome. Have you guys get more involved and see your Pokemon featured on the channel. Now, let's see what our man Yellow Flash has over here with the, with the lead. Am I recording? Yes, everything's good to go. Beautiful. I've been pretty upset. Cresselia Rhyperior. Cresselia Heat Ran. Fine by me. Uh, I'm just gonna go Trick Room Rock Slide because there's no way Heat Man's gonna stay in. Crap, it's sex here. Uh, let me just go Trick Room. I mean, he may flash cat me, but I really don't see him staying in. I'm just gonna go for a Rock Slide. Would he risk it though? He's gonna bring in Lando. Yo, let's get it. You know what? I'm feeling aggressive today, Town Squad. We're gonna Ice Punch the Heat Man slot. Call the Lando to come in. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made, Town Squad. Yeah. Oh, we do get the freeze up, but not like it really matters too much. Mistakes were made. Oh, that's why you don't get aggressive. Turn one, Town Squad, but I wanted it. I wanted it. Now. He's gonna go with like Trick Room and then whatever else. I'm gonna stay with my Cresselia for now. I'm gonna Ice Beam his crest and just go for EQ. Try to see if I can eliminate that. If not, mm. would he switch out here? I'll just go Rock Slide because he might switch it out. I'm gonna go Rock Slide here in the case he switches it out. I think I think it will switch out for set. I'll switch out Reverse Trick Room. All right, well. What else could go wrong right now, Talon Squad? What else? I'm assuming he went trick from here. Frozen solid, and yeah, there it is. All right. All right, now do I go for the same thing? Trick room protect this time. I think I do. I'm gonna go trick room. And I'm gonna bring in Sapu Finny, save by Pyrrhia for a little bit. Cause I've been tricking him up in an Ice Punch threat for that Landris. Could be really good. I got way too aggressive, but you know what? What? We can have a little bit of fun with this, my friends. We can have a little bit of fun right now. Bring in that Finny. Terrain goes up in case we see a Toxic or something coming. Ah, uh, on that side, that's gonna happen. Sunny Day! This man's in my head, dude. This man is in my head. There goes my Water Stab. The Fluff. Oh man, I'm just trying to spam combines now. 
And I'm 195% spamming combines right now, because you can't eject me, and you can't poison me. Uh, I'm gonna go trick him again. And I'm just trying to go combines. Yeah, I'm just trying to do that. If it doesn't get reversed, so be it. Let's do that. This is a weird game right now. This is a really weird game. We have Sunny Day Cresselia. Goes for the helping hand. I'm, screw I'm just screwing myself at every point right now, talent squad. Get those calm minds going. We got a plus one, plus one. Finny's son is up, though. So Mighty Wars going to be damaged. Still frozen. And I reverse trick room. <laughs> ah, the 50-50s are so much fun. Let's try it again. Yeah, only have one trick room. Oh no! This is the first time we're gonna run out of trick rooms, possibly. He's just trying to get this heat ran to do heat ran things, man. Thought out! Honestly, like, yeah, it's not stab, even though it's helping hand boosted. I'm fine with this. Plus two, plus two, Finny. Uh, I'm gonna start spending money water now. Sunny days, it should be going around. I doubt it's a heat rock uh, Cresselia, so we're gonna do that. He's gonna go for a sec. I'm gonna go muddy water. Try to load some accuracy over here. Uh, Moonlight is boosted right now. Fun little fact: Ice Beam Cresselia and muddy water. At plus two, it kind of like negates the sun because I'm like at plus two. I think the sun has it. Plus two puts it back to normal, so. I think some of the math works. I really don't know, but we're gonna try it out and see what happens. We're making this game so much harder than honest us, we have to make it. But a little bit of fun, a little bit of a little bit of early morning fun right now, my friends. Alright, not bad. Act drop on heat ram! Watch me freeze him now. Watch me freeze him now. He can't be frozen to his levitate. Oh, heat wave in the sun. Yeah, it does nothing. All right, Chicken is indeed reversed. I kind of want to go for it until like this Cresselia is dead. Uh, I'm gonna ice him the Cresselia. I, I only have one left, so I can't really afford to like, try to risk it right now. And I just go muddy water again. I'm gonna do this again. Yeah, I could have killed Heat Ran so many times. That's the best part. I could have killed Heat Ran so many times. Miss your Heat Wave. Hits both at neg one accuracy. Must be nice. There's no way I'm doing that. I tell that right now. And you're gonna burn Cresselia. Feels horrendous, man. All right. Well, there goes my trick of potential. All right. Kill that heat brand, but Cresselia act drop, act drop, act drop. Sun is gone. All right. There's no way I'm gonna trick him up. Not gonna moonlight up. That's gonna be it for Cresselia. It's gonna be like 2v3 basically because Propterior is essentially gone. Luff, man! Everything that could have gone wrong went wrong there. Yeah, I don't know what you bring in here. Uh. Sunny. Cresselia might honestly go Sunny Day again. Some weird tech. I guess there's just Heat Ran Heat Wave damage. Honestly. It's not a bad tech, but. Uh, it's good against weather, so it's really not that bad, man. Gets rid of sand, gets rid of rain. Not bad, I dig it. Alright, so what you bring in, you, you have like, you have a Landers in the back, you have Kangaskhan, this Kangaskhan, get a fake at Cresselia here. Alright. Uh. I'm obviously gonna try to Trick Room, but. It's probably not gonna have to do that. And maybe I should Moonblast Kangaskhan. Instead of muddy water and keep Cresselia because he, he has a berry. Yeah, I'm gonna Moonblast Kangaskhan. I'm gonna risk muddy water. Especially if he goes to Sunny Day, too. So let's do that. He's gonna think Sunny Day. I don't know if I want this up or down. Put it back down. This armrest. Alright. So the thing is, he's probably gonna fake a Cresselia, take care of it. Cresselia might go Sunny Day. As it doesn't really want to trigger my Finny Berry because I might that it would double edge, honestly. So he's allowed to just double edge my Finny, and then like try to kill Crush with an Ice Beam or a Psychic, or does he just go straight up fake out Cresselia, play it safe? Let's see what he does. Double edge, see? Oh wow, double edge Cresselia. All right. 
There goes that. We're gonna see some recoil. Sunny day! Exactly. Okay. And our Moon West and King is kinda plus two. He should be down to like a third of his health. Exactly. Spitzack falls. You don't care about that too much. Alright. I'll bring him more while just lowers his sack and get Sucker Punch ready for that Kangaskhan. But he may suck a punch as well. There's so many crazy things going on right now. More while comes in. What if he has Fire Punch too? That would be insane. All right, we're probably going to see a Lando come in. But we're going to Mega Evolve and go for that. Actually, maybe I'll just double switch out. Nah, I'm going to just kill him. I'm going to go with Sucker Punch, Kangaskhan, and Moonblast the Cresselia. That's what I'm going to do. Well, Betty, yeah, I should suck a punch Finny here and play it really safe. Trigger is Barry. I'll probably do that next turn. I'll do that next turn, yeah. I'll do that next turn if I, if I get what I want here. Make sure I'm not in EQ range. Crest is out of here! Lando shows his face. Alright, King of Scott might love this now. And if it's AV, we're going to find out if Lando is AV'd right here. He also wanted to double edge the Finny. I should have gone Sucker Punch on my own. But at the same time, you, if I, I could still kill King is the Sucker Punch. Even at Neg 1, there's still a chance. There's still a chance. Alright, beautiful. Beautiful. That's, honestly, that's fine. For its second, it's going to reveal Sucker Punch is going to fail. We're going to Moonblast that uh, Lando. And it's not AV'd. I think we win this game now. That was phenomenal. Wow! We got it! We didn't make it pretty! We didn't make it easy! But we do get that win, I believe. Alright, so should I sucker punch my own Pokemon here? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna sucker punch my own Pokemon. But if I do it at the same time, I can't I might not die. And Double Edge could still kill me. I don't even know if I trigger the berry at Neg 1. So I don't know, I don't know if it's worth... Alright, Sucker Punch King is gone. I can't. I don't know if it's worth. Sucker Punch King is gone, and... Protect Finny. Let's do that. Just in case King Sound doesn't die, because I'm at Neg 1 now. Bup, bup. Helping hands! Alright, that's that. Fitty protects just in case. See? Alright, beautiful. That was the right play. Now we're good to go. We have plenty of time. I'll just spam Sick Bunch of Kings until it works. And then Moonblast, Finny, and that's gonna be the game. I mean, Chrysalia. Beautiful, ma'am. Sure. That's obviously happening. Uh, we're gonna second punch fail. Icy winds. Speed drops. I mean, we're already slow as crap all anyway. Moonblast. Let's see a plus two if we can kill. Oh, one HP trick in that berry. Yeah, damn it! I mean, like I guess it's not the end of the world. Just spam second punch till it works. Mago berry, too. Mmm. Alright, Sucker Punch Kangaskhan. And... Moonblast Finny. And yeah, there we go. Alright, like I said. Wasn't pretty. Wasn't optimal. It just shows we played so aggressive and we still ended up winning that game despite the mistakes early on. And it feels pretty good, my friend. So that is that. I mean, the freeze on Heat Ran kind of helped. But that if that, like, didn't happen, I would have been more aggressive up here. Probably would have kept him in and whatnot. So... A little bit of a weird game right there. That's going to be game one. We're going to move into game two. And that will be that. Continue battling. Yes! Let's put on some... Rainbow Rocket, my friend. Some good old Rainbow Rocket. Alright, battle number 40 coming in hot right now. What else could I have done differently there? The Sunny Day kind of threw me up a little bit. Um, The biggest thing was Alco and that Lando with Moonblast. That was the biggest game change in my opinion. We got a friend, a friend from Takushima, Japan, rocking out with a stack attack. I haven't seen one for a hot minute. Pure trick him as well. But my 
my team is a lot slower than your team. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, uh, you know who's really good right now? Rhyperior. You know who I'm gonna go with? Rhyperior, Cresselia lead. Cresselia, Rhyperior. Also, I, ha I have Fake Out, though. Mm. Cresselia, Rhyperior, Sapu Finny, and Mawile again, I think. Yeah, it's gonna be our, our team right there, my friends. You're gonna lead, like, Stack Attack a Crest, or you're gonna lead, like... Whatever, I don't know, man. You're only one of those guys, I would say. Second deck is pretty weak to my team. That's like Muddy Water, that's the EQ, Bradley MZ. Uh, can't do much to Mega Morwa, can't do much to Ferrothorn. You might ever bring the stack attack. You might just bring the Cresselia, which is why Incineroar would be really good here. But if I get Combine Finny going again, it's not a problem. Oh, look, oh, oh. Mm. Flingle, dude. Do I Trick Room for Sex? Yeah, I definitely do. I don't think I can die outside of Wood Hammer and like, like a double double Z move, so it's not gonna happen. I'm just gonna go for Trick and Protect turn one. No, I'll be that. EQ damage is reduced right now. I gotta keep that in mind. So as I was saying, I don't know if I can live a Wood Hammer right now, Cresselia. I'm a little nervous. So I'm not gonna lie. Let's see. Yeah, man. Like, I might be gone. I am. That's game. That is game. That is 195% game right now. Blah. If only I brought Infinity. And then, I, I don't know if he has Woodhammer. I, I, I guess it's like my fault. Such if I'll bring him more while here, obviously. Uh, and I guess I gotta go for the double, man. Fight Mega Evolve. I could play Rough Kamo. I'll get rid of it. I think Iron Head on Blue is very obvious. Let's see that Blue is the bigger threat. So let me Iron Head the Blue and bring in Finny. Hopefully I can live a Wood Hammer with that terrain up. Get my Berry off and then like hopefully Kamo just fails. I'm in bad shape now. Losing Crest early that really sucks. I didn't know my calcs. I didn't, I couldn't assume if he had Wood Hammer or not. Whatever seems to be. Far near nowadays, or far, uh, whatever. I don't know what that saying is, but I haven't seen Woman for a while, is, is the, uh, what I'm trying to say right now. He is also at neg one, they're both at, well, he's at neg one. Kamo is at like plus one instead of plus two. I don't know how it works. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Game's over. Game is over. Alrighty, Town Squad, Game 3, we got the Rain Squad, Pelipper, Coco, uh, Scizor, Aegislash, Lando, and the lovely, uh, Ludicolo, like I said, getting rid of C-Tar made this matchup a little bit harder, but it's also not the end of the world either. What we gotta do here is go Cresselia, Incineroar, bait the Aegislash to attack the Cresselia, switch it out, knock off Aegislash, kill him, bring Cresselia back in at some point, and hopefully, um... That's way it's gonna work, but you're gonna go with Pelipper Aegis Slash, and I'm just gonna lose this game. But my best bet is hopefully don't leave with the rain and do what I just said. So I do that, that. Uh Ferrothorn's pretty good here, obviously. And last but certainly not least. We bring Finny for terrain control and water boost damage. I think we have to. Literally think we have to, my friends. That's going to be our game three squad. And I don't want to lose this one, but I'm going to do my best to win it. But if I lose, I'm going to be upset to go out with like a, uh, what do you call it here? A one-two record of, of this team for the last time. Flop! But it never yet. Got to play the game to see what happens first. Here we go, my friends. Talent squad, game three. Let's get it. Hopefully, uh... Hopefully we do good. Let's see what she does here. Don't be Pelper Aegis. We Aegis Slash. I don't know what. Pelipper Ludicolo. Alright. Uh We're just gonna trick room bring in Ferrothorn, I think. So if I do that, there's like 
Yeah, I'll do that, and then probably switch it to the Finny. I gotta, I gotta switch a lot. I'm gonna do that. Bring in the Ferrothorn here. If he gets the Rego's Hurricane, so be it. Um, But I think you should go with Double Team Cresselia here. Oh, there we go. All right, get some good damage right there. Get some damage in that Ludicolo. Very nice. It's a Brine as well. Beautiful. All right, turn one looking phenomenal for us. Trick Room goes up. I can job all the hell of that Ludicolo right now. But uh, I'm going to end up psychicking the Pelipper here. Break its Sash. Hit the Pelipper Psychic and then with the Ferrothorn. I'll bring in the Finny here. So I think Ludicolo wants to switch out into like... Something to do with the Ferrothorn. Pelipper's gonna hurricane that slot. Ludicolo might even just protect here. And if he does, I'll start going for Combines because Giga Drain isn't gonna hurt too, too bad. As it's mostly like an AV Ferrothorn. I can still switch out Finny a lot. It's gonna be a lot of mind games right now, my friends. I gotta work for this win. We're gonna do our best to get that W. So, bring in that Finny. Get that going. We know it's Brian Pelipper, not Skull the Hydro Pump. Ludicolo is that here, like I said. We're gonna see that Aga Slash coming. Fine by me. Could have leached it, honestly, actually, but. This works too. With that Pelipper Psychic, do about a third at most to it. Ooh, a little bit more. Not too bad. There's that Hurricane. And we're going to eat that up pretty well. And we're not going to bother with the Combines here. We're going to go for a Psychic on the Pelipper again. And we're going to go for a Muddy Water. So I don't think Aces should kill me this range. I really don't. I think I have just enough HP to get that berry to live and get that berry off. This is exactly what I'm going to do. Oh, no, but he, if he goes Y-Guard, that's fine. I can Hurricane again and my Barry Triggers and then Y-Guard again. But I'll risk the Y-Guard right here. That's fine. They both get Y-Guard, too. So if you go Y-Guard, Pelipper, and attack Aegis, that is the worst-case scenario, man. But I'm risking it. I'm risking it, Sound Squad. Gotta get a little risky, frisky if you wanna make things interessante. So you know what? Risk that Y-Guard. Pelipper's out of here. Let's see if Aegis has it. Blue Clo is back in business. That's fine. Get some free damage on him. It's a Z move. All right, Egg. I will trade Crest for Aegis Slash any day of the week because Trickle's already up. His job is kind of done. Aegis Slash will die to Muddy Water in the rain in his freaking attack form. Let's just go for Finny here. Then I'm in really bad shape. So you might be going for Finny here. I don't know. I think I lose. I think I just lost. That was a whole spiral of venture there, Talos. But I had a whole freaking up high area. Oh, okay, good. That's fine. That's fine. That is honestly fine. Could limit too many babies. All right, there it goes. Crit, okay. Now we're never gonna know. But goodbye, Cresselia. Muddy Water just connected. I'm a happy camper. Beautiful. All right, I guess it should be dead. Ah, damn it. Act Drop is huge, though. Act Drop is huge. Uh, I'll bring in Ferrothorn here, obviously. Hmm. Did I just Leech Seed Aegis Slash? I'm gonna Gyro Ludicolo and Finny's gonna go for a Calm Mind. That's what I'm gonna do. I, th I think Azish protects here. Ludicolo goes fake out on either Finny or Fer- or I don't think you fake out the Ferrothorn. You might just Giga Drain Finny. And with Trick Room being up, I think Azish is almost forced to King Shield because you're a little bit scared right now. If you get aggressive, more power to you. Really bad for me if you get aggressive. I'm calling you to be defensive here. Cross out that Trick Room. Keep that rain going in your favor. Ludicolo is out of here. All right, we're going to see Scizor come in. Okay, okay. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. We're going to gyroball Scizor. Get a little damage on him. Y guard indeed revealed. So I can't go Money Warders for free anymore. But we do get the plus one plus one for free, which is pretty nice. Uh. I guess I'll Leech Seed Scizor and just Moonblast Aim Slash. Let's do that. Leech Seed Scizor, Moonblast, Aegis Slash. Oh, you know what? He's gonna bug bite Finny. Ooh, bad, bad, bad for me. Bad, bad, bad. 
Mega Scizor in the building. Ooh, this is really bad, honestly. Forgot about Bug Bite. Yeah, there's a stance change. Yeah. Oh, it failed. That my beautiful. Beautiful. So we're gonna leech it him. We're gonna Moonblast the uh, Aegisesh. Hopefully kill it at plus one. Yeah, all right, get that thing out of here. And then, out of the bug, not out of the bug bite. Oh, we go with Swords Dance. <gasps> okay. Wide Guard is gone as well. He's probably gonna protect here. All right, do you bring in Pelipper or Ludicolo? That's the question, Pelipper or Ludicolo? Trick Room is gone. So I'm gonna say Pelipper, honestly. Should I? If you bring in Pelipper, I'm gonna switch to the Ferrothorn. I mean, switch to the uh, Incineroar. Hmm, do I? Uh, it depends how scared I am. Like, bug, because Bugbite's still neutral on the Incineroar, and you'll eat my berry no matter what. I don't want to power up the. Oh, this is so tough. This is so tough. He also might have Wygar and Pelipper, but it's not likely. Um. I'm just gonna try to whittle away the Scizor. I think I'm gonna Gyro Ball Scizor. And protect on Finny. So I think you go Hurricane Bullet Punch here. Or Hurricane Bug. I want to see if you have Bug Bite. There's the Bullet Punch. Yeah, okay, so no Bug Bite. Oh, wow. Very good. Very good. So, as a case, if I switched out, uh, terrain is gone. I know the Gyre Ball will kill Scizor with the Leech Seed. Mm. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna die to a what oh, well, actually I probably would die to a plus two bullet punches. No way I'm living that. No way I'm living that. I'll bring in Cinnamor and I can't I can't sack off the I can't I can't risk losing Finny. Incineroar is kinda useless anyway. Well, uh I don't know. This is tough guys, this is tough! But I think we're doing good so far. I think we're doing good. That's fine. Oh no! And he does have the bug bite. Fluff and nutter, dude. Well, made the worst possible play there. Why won't he just use it to begin with? God damn it, dude. We're gonna lose now. Get confused. And of course, oh. of course, dude. What else could go wrong there? My God. Uh, rip, guys. We're gonna go one two. Should have just left Finian down from the muddy water. There you go. Pull a punch. Leech Seed, Pelipper, do I have taxes, or what do I do here? Leech Seed, Pelipper, and... I'm not gonna have plus one, plus one anymore. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I just lost because of that. Scizor switches out. Okay. All right. Parathorn. 
All right, the good news is Gyro really hurts. This is that quadruple speed. He's at quadruple speed on that Ludicolo. Jarball really hurts. You know what? This, this is back. That was a misplay in his part. Wow. All right. Jarball the Ludicolo. And I'm going to Moonblast the Pelipper. No bug by a chance. I can actually get my berry off. He we're, honestly, we're okay. If you fake out Finny, so be it. I'm not gonna die to Hurricane and fake out. I'm not gonna die to Brian and fake out either. Wow, I'm surprised it's just that scissor out, man. We are still alive, guys. We are still alive in this game now. We're fighting for this. We gotta make some emotions right now, Talent Squad, and I wanna win this. Quadruple Speed Ludicolo is gonna get popped by this Gyro Ball. I'm gonna live that. Barry's gonna go off. I don't know if it's going to pop him, but it's going to really, really, really hurt him. There's that. That's fine. Moonblast kills Pelipper. Which I really don't want, but... Actually, that's fine. Beautiful, beautiful. Ah, I did a lot less than I thought it would. Damn it, dude. All right, obviously, uh, Ferrothorn is a huge threat here. We're going to Leech Seed Scizor and just go for a Moonblast because he might double team Ferrothorn. He might have to. Gonna go for a Skull Branch for sure. Uh, Leech Seed Scizor and try to just attack with Finny. He might go Swords Dance. I'll keep Finny around an extra turn just in case. I'm gonna protect you with Finny. I will do that. See, I don't know if he could afford to try to go for Swords Ants here. He might just go. Well, actually, he might because I, I don't know what he does. Uh, Finny's gonna stay around an extra turn. There is a Swords Dance. Alright. Leech Sheet is there. Beautiful. Tailwind is up, so Gyro is going to kind of hurt. Alright, now we got to protect the Ferrothorn here. It's like a Scald Bug Bite might really hurt. Protect on Ferrothorn, and Finny will go for a uh, Double Protect, because why not? It's gonna fail, that's fine. Ferrothorn gets the protect off. We're in this, guys. We're in this. You're gonna get like 15 HP back from that because Pokemon rounds down. Alright. Need for the other swords and see. Ah, I should have gone Gyro Ball. Damn it. Alright. If I had sacked, it would have been great. We got to protect that here. Oh, I'm in great shape. Damn it. Okay, so we won that 50 50. Talon is gone now. Jarboy ain't gonna do nearly as much. Uh, I'll just deal with this scissor. We're good to go. Oh, he ran out of time. I win! He ran out of time, Talon Squad! Let's go! <laughs> Thank you for watching, as always. I'm Mr. Talon. You are the glorious Talon Squad. Have a phenomenal day. Leave a comment down below what you thought about that episode and a Pokemon that's made around, guys. Have a great day. Love your faces. I'll see you next time.